Hey, what is going on guys? So you have a Samsung Galaxy Note 8 or Note 9. I'm going to show you how to do a forced restart. Basically, when you do a forced restart, you're not you're not going to lose any data. You're not going to lose your photos or videos or any files. Doing a forced restart is basically just like if you have your computer on and you press and hold the power button until it turns off. Okay, now you do a forced restart if you're having issues with your phone. Maybe you have a black screen of death. Uh, there's, where your screen is just totally black, but you know it's on, maybe you can feel it vibrate or you hear it ring or see some LCD or LED lights and whatnot. Or maybe your phone is just frozen and you're not able to uh, re reboot or restart your, um, your Note 8 or Note 9. Anyways, it's, it's a two key combination here. It's gonna be the volume down button and the power button, okay? So you wanna press and hold both of these buttons at the same time and continue to hold until you see the Samsung logo appear. So let's pretend I have an issue with my phone here. Let's pretend this uh, Note 8 has a black screen of death. I can't see nothing on here, okay? So follow along. Volume down, power button, ready? One, two, three, press and hold. Continue to press and hold. Both of these buttons do not let go. Let's pretend my screen is black, okay? Continue to hold. And Okay, I just felt it vibrate a little bit, okay? I'm still holding on. I'm not going to let go until I see a Samsung logo appear. Okay, just vibrate it again. Okay, so there we go. Samsung logo appears. Now I can go ahead and let go and I should be back in business. Now the thing is, if you guys are still having issues, like a black screen still, or it still it, it, it's, uh, becomes frozen or whatnot, what you want to do is do the same thing five or six more times, okay? Remember, volume down, power button press and hold. You may have to try it five or six more times. Now, if you're still having issues, the next thing that I would advise is go ahead and plug your phone in, go ahead and let it charge for about three to five minutes. And then while it is still plugged in, come back and do the same key combination again and keep trying. If your phone is still having issues, then go ahead and give it another five or six more tries while it is plugged in. If you guys still have issues or any issues with your phone, just comment below and I'll help you guys out. Anyways, there you guys go. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.